is after a young girl dies. This began Friday when the four year old was found in a bathtub in a home. Little Avery Hobbs died on Monday and homicide detectives are now investigating. It's a story Local 12 broke online. Sydney Better is live with more on what family members are saying tonight. Sydney. Rob, Avery Hobbs died here at Children's Hospital yesterday afternoon. The initial call for help that came on Friday night uh, suggested there was a child found in a bathtub. I talked to Avery's grandparents just a little bit ago, though, and they say they have their doubts. They think Avery was badly abused and beaten. I want to show you video from that scene Friday night. That happened on uh, Beach Avenue in Lower Price Hill. Cincinnati police are now investigating the circumstances surrounding Avery's death. Hamilton County Coroner Dr. Lakshmi Samarco says preliminary reports from Children's indicate some trauma. Although we don't yet know what the official cause of death is, Avery's grandparents told me the little girl they had custody of for years was badly abused by her mother. And in court, all I heard was in the best interest of the child, that's what Job and Family Services kept saying in court. This is what's in the best interest of the child. And I want them to know that my little child that I raised here is dead. Is that what's in the best interest of a child? And Avery's grandparents say that they fought for the last year to try to regain custody of their granddaughter. They say that they documented evidence of abuse on Avery and that she also detailed graphic stories of abuse to them. We'll have much more on this story coming up for you on Local 12 News live at 11 this evening. But for now, reporting at Cincinnati Children's Hospital, Sydney Benter, Local 12 News. Rob. Sydney, thanks very much. Officials with the Department of Job and Family Services say it is involved indeed in this case, but would not comment other than to say it is cooperating with police.